Hello students of class 7. The other day we have started the revision of the poem uh, The Power of Music and uh, we have seen uh, in the first stanza what effect it, uh, the song has on the people that is uh, the moment the people uh, hear the song uh, they are you know, confused uh, they don't know what to do and so you know they run everywhere and people um, crush uh, you know other means there's a sort of or, you know they trample or rather they walk over each other um, and there is you know a situation of panic uh, everywhere because everybody is trying to uh, search for a um, place you know uh, where they can go um, to avoid uh, listening to the song um, and it's also said that the people can understand that uh, Bhishma Lajan is singing uh, not to trouble anybody uh, but uh, he mm, he likes singing for that reason uh, now let's read uh, the you know the next uh, part of the poem and plead my friend we are near our end oh stop your singing quickly so the people you know uh, when they are running here and there in search of silence they also you know request Beach Palachan to uh, stop his singing you know because they say that you know if you continue singing we are almost going to die we, we cannot take in this noise anymore so uh, please uh, stop your song and what happens the bullock carts are overturned so the bullock means uh, so long we have seen you know the effect it has on the uh, people but now you know the animals you know, they are uh, no way you know in a better position what happens all of a sudden when Bhishma Dachan starts singing you know the bullock carts they just in, uh, the you know um, that is the animals who are pulling the uh, cows or the buffaloes who are pulling the cart you know uh, they are also you know confused and uh, they are I mean, the bullock carts are overturned that is they turn upside down the bullock carts are overturned and horses line uh, the roadside so the horses uh, also have they also have to travel in a certain direction so they are deviated so you know, uh, there is uh, what the poet uh, wants to tell us that there is a situation of chaos everywhere because of this song. And uh, but uh, you know, does Bhishma Lachan understand that you know everything means uh, what effect is has on the uh, people or the animals? His song, no. But Bhishma Laj, unconcerned, unconcerned means he is totally unaware and he is going on singing you know, as loud as he can. Unconcerned goes booming out his broadside. So booming out, see this boom, this very sound is like a blast, you know, uh, when we... Um, uh, during Diwali and all, uh, when you uh, burst the crackles, you know, those uh, bombs, to, uh, you know, they go boom and that way. So uh, it's like, uh, you know, we associate it with uh, bombs and all. So uh, we can understand, you know, of course uh, he has used it humorously. So. Um, it is not a song anyway, it's like a blast that is happening. So booming out is broadside. Broadside means a verbal attack. Okay, a verbal attack. So uh, broadside uh, would mean that as though, you know, this uh, song is not a song as such, but it is an attack, you know, a uh, it's a kind of a um, punishment or uh, rather you know um, they, the means Bhishma Lachan is uh, trying to have a verbal um, 
attack on uh, people that is to say his uh, means uh, the quality of his song is such it seems as though he is uh, you know he is uh, having a, a fight a verbal fight okay a verbal a quarrel in that way uh, instead of a song so uh, booming uh, out his broadside the wretched brutes wretched brutes here refers to the animals wretched means poor the wretched brutes resent the blare see the words blare boom okay all these uh, suggest you know um, that you know, uh, his song is no better than noise okay so the wretched brutes resent uh, blare the hour they hear it sounded so they also resent means they also you know uh, detest they don't dislike okay they dislike the song they whine and stare with their feet in air so um, what happens is that you know they start crying out loudly you know they call out loudly these all these animals and you know they roll and you know their feet is in the air you have the picture in your book um or wonder caught quite confounded that is you know even they are confused they don't understand what they are supposed to do so uh, we find that bishwa lachan does not understand but his song uh, has a um, negative impact on uh, not only people but also on animals the fishes dive below the lake in frantic search for silence so not only the you know um uh, uh, not only the um, um animals in land but also the fishes okay they also you know cannot tolerate this song and so they go deep inside the water frantic frantic means they are desperate okay they uh, want to you know um, they go very deep down into uh, the lake so that they are not able to hear the song so they are desperate in search of a silence um the very trees collapse and shake you hear uh, them crash a mile hence and the sky in thy uh, the and the in the sky the feather fly turn turtle while they are winging so uh, what effect does it have um, on the feather fly feather fly here means the birds so they turn turtle and what about nature you know even hearing the song there's a, a kind of a effect of an um, like an earthquake because Uh, you can hear that after the you know after uh, you know here in the song even the trees okay <coughs> they fall down they collapse they fall down and uh, you can also hear them for you hear the trees falling down so this was uh, so we find that not only people but nature animals all you know detest the song of bhishma lachan shar thank you students we will do the next half of the poem in the next class